Mm -hmm. Oh. One guy over there. Wonder if anyone would notice the missing gun. Shadow kill is really handy when it comes to stuff like that. Should be able to probably expensive. I think there's one more around here somewhere. Hey, oh, yep. That was him. Well, it's just one of them. They don't bother calling out, so we're fine. War medal, nice chunk of money. Let's listen to the audio while we find our own more stuff. Need to know what you expect regarding the Danforth Holding Company. They're only a month late, and they've been good for it in the past. Normally, I wouldn't hesitate to invent a plague infection complaint against them and have all their assets seized, but they have a link to the boils, and they, as you know. The do not touch list. It's hitting a little too close to home. I'm afraid you may have to settle your dispute with them by some other means. Hmm. There's a lot of corruption here. Honestly, I don't really feel like this guy deserves to live, so I'm not gonna bother too much. Uh The dumb waiter thing. I wonder if we can use that. Let's see if we can Did climb down. Actually, well, maybe we'll die. I don't think it's a good idea. We need a key for that one. Um, can we... Let's go this way. Might be stairs down. Or up? Okay. I need to know if there's any guards here before I start looting too much. This seems thoroughly empty. Empty. <laughs> I guess he wants his mom to die. Find that out in the will, I imagine. I need to find that key. Where is he keeping it? Wiles Roland. Uh, this is Arnold. If you happen to awake him while no one is present, I've prepared this for you to remind you of recent events to help clear your mind and put you at ease. The plague has ended. I have married and will become Prime Minister, just as you always wanted. My sister and brother are both here and doing well. Your last will and testament has been written and approved. We all love you. Now go back to sleep. Rest. Everything is fine. <laughs> well. When pretty Emily woke one day, she saw the world a different way. Her eyes now looked with a stranger's guile, her dainty mouth smiled a stranger's smile. Her hands now worked the stranger's wrath, her feet now walked a stranger's path. 
Emily fed and other grew stronger. The stranger's cravings drove her onward. And no one who looked in Emily's face ever guessed who ruled in Emily's place. I don't like the sound of that. At all. Who are you? I understand your curiosity. And strange. I was a baker's apprentice in Dunwall Tower. A friend to Jessamy when we were girls. Then afterward, I made my name as a painter. Now, I'm obviously something much greater. Satisfies you because you won't get more. I ought to just kill you. But I'm going to give you a warning for the sake of my sisters. Who were there in with you once upon a time? Stay away from me. There are great changes coming, and I'll expect you not to interfere. But as for Arnold Timsch, do what you want. I won't hold a grudge. I'm done with him. Is that who you were looking for? Well, she's a bit of a bitch. And the artwork's hopeless. I know you have your reasons. What the hell is this? I... I want to know more. I better find out more. I wish I could question her, or question the outsider, but that'd be a ticket to an early grave. <sighs> I'll just deal with the barrister then, but if this is Delilah, what did the outsider want me to see? Well, air circulator, location office, blah blah blah. Take the whale statue. I, what the hell is that? Living statue that speaks. Who are her sisters? Oh, hello. Not quite as smoothly as I intended it to, but whatever. And the will. Who's shouting now? I need the chest key. Is that just a guard? City unencumbered by plague provisions. Uh, Quiet. I keep the document with me at all times. Never know. Ah, what makes you among the smartest, would you say? Just an example. Take the rat plague. Boohoo, yes. What a calamity. Half the city is bleeding out its eyes. Half the people I know have been ruined. Meanwhile, I've tripled my fortune. Go ahead. Ask me how. How, sir? The key is to create a buffer zone. Take the areas that surrounded the hives of infection and blockade them. Empty them. What do you think these guards do all day? Go into the core city where the plague's worst. 
Make sure folks who got it worst get out to the flooded district. Turn over anything they've got to the public trust. Useless. Anybody who's got the plague, they sell all their goods just to buy some crackpot cure. And they'll fight. We're losing men every day. No, no, but stupid goddammit. Of course. Sending men in to evict middle class families before the plague even appears. Money. What's the point of evicting poor people? They're dying anyway. Well said, sir. And shopkeepers can fight worth a damn. So no one gets hurt. In that case, I must have full reign of empty houses all around the high city. You it makes me sick. It's amazing how in every type of crisis that leaves people suffering, some people always find a way to make profit. It has some merit. So, he has a bunch of stuff on him. Possibly including that key. That would be pretty handy. Hmm. Non lethal is to switch the document in his pouch and place the sack inside the air circulator thing. Or I can just kill him. Bunch of random noblemen down there. Uh, it might be hard. I'd like to pickpocket him, but it's going to be pretty hard. Is he always going to be with him? Mm. Looks like. Should we gather for whiskey and cigars tonight? Mm. Never doubt it. Let's get him sorted. And let's find that air circulator which was on that down floor down here. Now there were two people. I cannot see the second guy. I guess we'll see where he is. No idea where that other guard is. on the other side of that room. <laughs> it's tempting to just go up there and stab him and be done with it. Yeah, the key from his own belt. Lockpicks are a fable. Mm -hmm. Where is the thing? Uh, right there. 
Now I have the state key. Which means I should go up there and get the other one. 